funky is this? There she is. Check it out. Not even joking, dude. Not even joking. What's that brand over there? Nothing. Just a little chill. All American. Okay, so we're going to do the initial unboxing and uh, initial review of the Hoover Wet and Dry vacuum cleaner that I've been so excited to get. This is definitely not a sponsored post of any kind, but um, I am a huge Hoover fan. They're one of the top American brand legends. And ex-presidents. And ex-presidents. Ex uh, apparently they sucked up all the water in this one dam and then put it in another dam that's where the Hoover Dam name comes from it's exactly where it comes from so let's unbox this sucker okay so at a first glance this is what you get welcome to the Hoover family it's a boy this is that this is my design for South Africa, that's my cool. This is the, that's a pipe. So I'm gonna put this over here. Put that over there. Okay, so first it's like, oh no, what's happening? There's a, there's only just this box and then this pipe and this pipe. But here's a little secret. If you, Pop that guy. You knock that Pop this guy. What's that? You knock that oh. And inside you get all the goodies. It's like an Easter egg. So there's this. That's the funnel. I used to spin those around as a kid. There's this, which that's for cleaning inside shoes. And this is for cleaning outside, outside of shoes. There it is, completely set up. <coughs> it's, uh, I've plugged it in. in the mess. And uh, let's give it a shot. Brilliant. Make a funny noise when you put that. Let's try it. Pop it. You want to? Lovely, lovely, lovely. Good. I really want to try the blow function. Let's try the blow. Really fancy. Really well. Look at that. I don't know if it's good. The house isn't that dusty right now. Let's just give it a shot, could we? No. Just gonna blow these packets. The out facing outside. So we look this way. Here we go, move. I'm gonna turn it. Yeah, that's all it does. Blow is really good. Can you feel that? Can you feel it? Low function, I'm going to give it like a 3 out of 10. Okay, so I've been just vacuuming and I just want to make sure I've got the setup correct. Okay, guys, that pretty much sums up my uh, review, if you will. Of, uh, of the Hoover wet and dry tank vac. Uh, just to give you like one more recap, it's it's 1,800 watts, pretty powerful, but you know, not the max for a standard vacuum cleaner today. You get a lot of Panasonics, uh, a lot of Samsung, Samsung's gonna make vacuum cleaners. I know Matt Manning just got a, a 2,400 wattage in a far smaller package. So, uh, not really impressed with the power, but you know, I don't really need any. I'm busy reviewing the vacuum cleaner. 
Uh, I quite like the look. I think it's like a nice retro look. I'm gonna give it a two out of three. Uh, blowing functionality there. It's one of the huge draw cards for this particular device. They really want to drive home the blowing functionality. And uh, I must be honest, I'm not really impressed with the blowing functionality. I think you could do better with the straw. Uh, and then lastly, the, uh, the, what was I saying? And then wet and dry. I must be honest, I didn't try the wet function yet. I still need to take it out of the, uh, I, need, I need to take the, the, the dust bag out of the body of the vacuum cleaner to give it a, the, the wet a shot. But I'm not going to do that today because I first want to get the most out of the dust bag before I wash it. Uh, but yeah, uh, if you like my review, hit like, subscribe. I'm going to be doing a lot more vacuum cleaner reviews. Um, and yeah, thanks. Thanks for watching. Cheers.